Hey everyone, um, we have a new energy drink that we're taste testing here. And this is actually the first energy drink I've had from this company and actually the first product I've had from this company. So I'm, I'm, I hope I don't butcher the name, but um, Alani New, I hope that's how you say it. I'll probably learn how to say it a little bit better as we go on, but they have, um, not only do they have energy drinks, which is actually their newer venture, as you can see here, they also have like pre-workouts and things like that. So hopefully if things go well with, you know, some of their energy drinks that I have access to a little easier, I might be able to go and try some of their other pre-workouts and flavors on, the, on that kind of stuff. But Alani New, this is actually one of their newer flavors that they've just recently come out with. It's called Trippy Hippie. Um, and as you can see, the decorations on it are freaking awesome. I love some of these crazy designs they have on here. Honestly, it does really stand out if you see it in the store. Um, with this energy drink, they do have 200 milligrams of caffeine um, in here, I believe. Yep, 200 milligrams of caffeine. Um, so that's just something to keep in mind. This is not a low end energy drink. It's also not a high end energy drink as we see energy drinks with 350 to 300 milligrams. This is probably right in the middle. Um, it does have 10 calories per can, 20 milligrams of sodium, uh, four carbohydrates, there's no proteins. Um, and they have other things, they have potassium, niacin, which is 17 milligrams, B6, B12, biotin. Um, so some pretty decent stuff to wrap it up. It does appear to just be like a normal energy drink with its focusing on one, uh, caffeine amounts, but then also flavor. So um, we're gonna give it a try. I'm very interested what Trippy Hippie tastes like. I, again, I really love this design they have on the outside with all these characters. Um, I'm a big fan of stickers and would absolutely love some stickers of these characters, but that's neither here nor there. You guys are here to see what it tastes like and what my thoughts are on it. So again, 10 calories per can, 200 milligrams of caffeine. Um, let's go ahead and, and open it up, give her a try. All right, so from as you can see, oh, doesn't pour out very well, but not too bad. It is kind of more of like the yellow green color, pretty vibrant color um, in, in reality pretty strong neon style color. Of course it is carbonated as a lot of these energy drinks are. Smelling of it actually smells very strong of pina colada. So you get that coconut, that pina colada smell in there. Ooh, sorry. Carbonation got me. Um, so right off the, the only, the main flavor I'm getting is pina colada. And I'm really getting that coconut flavor. So it honestly, to me, tastes exactly like a carbonated pina colada. And so if you're looking for pina coladas as, as we get into the summer months here, and you want some caffeine, this is pretty good. It is a little different because it is, um, caffeinated and carbonated. So keep that in mind, but it's actually a really good flavor. I'm very impressed. I don't get any of the tart or the tanginess from any of the sweeteners, just straight pina colada with that carbonation. Um, I do feel like it's pretty heavily carbonated. So it's a good one to try. If you guys like pina colada, I'm not disappointed in this. Again, just so that you are aware, I'm not a big fan of coconut, so I probably will not be personally buying this again because I don't like coconut that much. But it's not bad. This is a good flavor, and it has that flavor profile for pina colada that people have come to know and love. So give it a try if you like pina colada. If you're not a big fan, I'd just say you probably should steer clear then because it tastes like pina colada. So otherwise, guys, if there's any other flavors, companies, brands that you'd like me to taste test for you, drop them down in the comments. If you've tried this and you have some other thoughts on it, let me know, I'm very interested. Um, in what your uh, takeaways are from this flavor. Otherwise, guys, don't forget to subscribe 
to my channel. That way you can know when I'm coming out with a new video. The notification bell on the side will help with that. Um, but until next time, everyone, bye.